Free Spirit Equestrian. My name is Shay, and in this video, we're gonna be doing barn chores galore. So we're gonna be doing all types of different things around the farm. We're gonna be scrubbing troughs. I'm gonna paint my run-in shed, give it a touch up. We're gonna be leveling sand out in the outdoor arena. Of course, you'll get to see the horses as well. I'm gonna be feeding them and you'll get to see them in the paddock and the pasture too. Really hope you enjoy horse lovers. Jiminy. Cruella. Be nice. Come here. Don't be a little grump. You're so cute. <laughs> so my parents are here visiting today and they're gonna help with some work on the farm. We're just petting the horses. Of course, it's morning time. <laughs> Corella is being her silly, sassy self. Everybody's doing really good, and it's just nice to pet them and spend some time with them in the morning before we get really busy with all of our work. So right here, we have Miss Cruella, who my mom's petting right now, Gaston, and then Mr. Olaf, who absolutely loves kisses, snuggles, and attention. They are just so sweet. This is my husband, Kyle. He's the best horse husband a girl could ask for. Absolutely adore him. And he's with Gaston and Olaf right here. Yep, that's my guy. Then we have Mr. Arlo and Mr. Wessel. They have been goofing around the past few days, having a blast. <laughs> They're so sassy. Of course, Prince Charming. Aw, look at you. With her ears. <laughs> you know, that's for shade. One of our projects for the day is we're going to be adding sand to our outdoor arena. As you can imagine, the perimeter of the arena, it wears down over time. We did the footing about four years ago and we've added some sand since then. But as you can see here, we added some more piles and my dad is scraping it with the box scraper and the tractor. We're going to level it out and then I will come in with the drag later in the four wheeler and smooth it out. So yeah, this is definitely like a good project to do today and I'm really excited. Pig daddy. So this is my little mini pig Penelope. If you haven't seen her, I love her so much. I'm obsessed. So she lives in the house. I just let her out. And um, yeah, she's gonna hang out in the barn today for a little bit. Potty time. You ready to go to the barn? <laughs> Say hi. <laughs> He's a good girl. Let me go, baby. Baby. She likes eating the leftover grain. <laughs> you on the hunt? You gonna be helping with barn chores today, Kala? Yeah? He's <laughs> good boy. Thank you. Yeah, you are. So this is the dump truck that we use to pick up sand. Uh, this was my grandpa. So it's been in my family for a while and I bought it um, last year. So I'm super excited. It's like really cool. It's like vintage, but functional. So yeah. Okay, so now my dad leveled everything out. So I'm gonna drag it so that it's really consistent. And I'm really excited to have new sand, especially on the perimeter. It definitely needed it. Dragging the arena is literally my favorite barn chore. It's like my ginormous zen garden. I have a blast doing it. It's where I do a ton of my thinking and it's just so satisfying. So I spent a lot of time on this so I only showed you a little bit of the dragging. But yeah, I'll show you the very end result later but you can see a little bit here. Definitely worth it. I do this about twice a week, I'd say. So this is cracked right here. So my dad and husband are gonna fix it. <laughs> you know I'm recording, right? Farmer John! That's my dad. All right, now I gotta drag this and then paint that. And then, yeah, let's do it. This is the before. Okay, take a look. All right, my mom and I, we're gonna drag the paddock now. 
So first my mom and I rode around to get into like the deep grooves, like the more weight on the four wheeler, the better. And then I got on because it's really bumpy to try to smooth out some of these bumps. So we drag this not only to level it out, but it just kind of mixes everything up, makes it softer footing for the horses, levels it out a little bit. And it's just good paddock maintenance. So that's why I'm doing this and it's just really good. And I obviously have a lot of fun doing this as well. I'm sure you can tell. <laughs> So now we're gonna do a little bit of pasture management, just making sure there's no like big holes or anything crazy out in the fields here. Also, Duke of Wesselton has pulled off everybody's fly mask, so we're also on the hunt for those. <laughs> oh, where would these be? We are looking for two fly masks. One of them is hot pink, one of them is black, so they could be anywhere. Okay, we found one. Okay, we got one. Just called the horses over. I'm gonna switch them over into this other pasture we were okay. just driving around in because the grass is a little longer. So they're walking through there. Miss Cruella, we have Olaf, Wesselton, Arlo right there. They love going into new pastures. Mr. Gaston, then we have Jiminy behind him. This is Prince Charming. <laughs> then we have Miss Bagheera and Jiminy waiting for Miko. He walked up by the main paddock, so he's coming over here. There, there he is, Mr. Miko. Also, here was the end result of our paddock dragging. So much better. All right, now it's time to scrub out the trough. So I gotta dump it first. I get back here. So it's really important to keep your troughs clean, scrub all that algae, dirt out. That way the horses are encouraged to drink more. That's definitely really important. And of course you just want them to have clean water. So I do this once a week at minimum, sometimes twice. Um, I'll definitely like spray it out in between scrubs, but I definitely scrub it out really good at least once a week in the summertime. You can see Gaston and Cruella are keeping me company. They're like, hey, where's the water? We need some. <laughs> but I really enjoy doing barn chores and taking care of my horses. Even though things are a lot of work, like I'm doing it because I'm taking care of my animals and it's very fulfilling, even though it can be very tiring. Easy. <laughs> <laughs> really? You're so silly. Hi, bud. Hi, bud. Now the horses have fresh, clean water, and of course it's afternoon snuggle time, so I have Mr. Olaf here. Again, he's just such a doll. He's a seven-year-old POA, and then I have Mr. Prince Charming, who also wanted some cuddles. He's doing really well. We're actually going for another follow-up appointment with the vet, so I will keep you guys updated. He's doing good, but I just still, I wanna make sure everything's going the way we planned, and I just wanna get a second opinion just to make sure that everything's good with him and that we can be on the fastest track to getting him healthy and happy. Miss Cruella is definitely a sass box. Look at her telling Gaston to back off. She is so funny, but she's so sweet to people. I absolutely adore that. Then we have Mr. Wessel, Prince Charming, getting a drink. Miko and Bagheera. And even Koa's getting a little drink too. Don't worry, he has his own water. Okay, this was the end result of the outdoor arena. Isn't it magnificent? And Kyle and my dad are still working hard on this beam. They had to take it all apart and then now they're gonna put some concrete in to secure this post. So that has been broken for four years. It's been driving me nuts. So I'm super happy. Now it's getting late afternoon, early evening. So I'm gonna bring the horses up. They're gonna get their feeding and that way they're out of the paddock and the pasture so that I can paint the run-in shed. They've all been having a really great day. 
It's not too hot, but the bugs are a little bad, so I'm gonna fly spray everybody and get them all squared away for the evening. They're all doing really well. And yeah, it's just been a lot of fun hanging out with them, taking care of them, doing stuff around the farm today. And I really hope that you're enjoying this process as well. All right, so we're scrubbing this. This is our bale barn. We're taking turns scrubbing and rinsing. Then we're gonna finish this up with a pressure washer and then I'm gonna paint it tonight. All right, horse lovers, now I'm gonna be painting my run-in shed. So I'm just gonna be touching up the spots that you can see need it. And it's the exact same paint. So luckily when it dries, it'll all look the same. And I'm just super excited because again, this has been bothering me. Looking at it, even from far away, I just want it to be touched up. My mom is gonna help me as well. As you can see, we've been very busy today trying to get a bunch of small projects done around the farm and it's going quite well. I'm so happy. I love being able to accomplish things on the farm and make things look better. Also, horse lovers, if you're enjoying this video, if you would hit that like button and leave a comment so that our channel can continue to grow, I'd really appreciate it. Thanks! Well, horse lovers, we definitely got a lot done on the farm today. Don't forget to buy some amazing merchandise from us. Link is in the description and hit that subscribe button along with the notifications so you don't miss any updates. See you next time. Bye.